Welcome back, Game Slayer, to another Animal Crossing Island tour. Now today I am <laughs> very, very excited. We are touring an island based on the Welsh town of Porth Call. You are in for a treat. So if you guys are from the UK, or from Wales even, like me, you may be familiar with Porth Call. Now some people may give this town a bad rap, but I don't believe it. I don't believe it. So I'm gonna firstly commend uh, my friend Jess for creating this island. She has never been to Porth Call, but decided to make this island on the request of somebody who watches the videos on my channel. So come on, that's amazing. Making a whole town just based on photos you've seen online is just, yeah, we should celebrate that in itself. So we're gonna have a little look at the map. I'll let you look at the map. The dream address is down below. We have Jess here. We also have Norm, which is hilarious because this is the person who requested the island. So Norm is from Porth Call area and just just loves Porth Call. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy this because this tour is for you. Um, the map even says Porth Call in the middle. Look how you've like pathed Porth Call. That is absolutely hilarious. And we have some amazing, amazing, <laughs> amazing um, villagers. Yeah, I couldn't even remember what I'm saying then. I'm too excited about being in Wales. Woohoo! So just a little bit of background. Porth Call is a town and it's a community on the south coast of Wales in the county borough of Bridgend. 25 miles west of the capital city Cardiff and 19 miles southeast of Swansea. So that's what you'll find if you Google Porth Call. Have a look at the photos online and yeah, you tell me if Jess did Porth Call justice in the comments below or maybe you are from Porth Call or Wales. So please let me know. She's given me some adorable clothes that were left as gifts. I have come for a dream dress. Let's go. I'm excited. So as we've come in, we've got a lot of Wales merch. I'm up for it. I'm feeling it. I'm Welsh through and through. So yeah, I'm excited. And you're going to see me do this a lot in this video because uh, yeah, I've never had one of these. <laughs> so let's have a look. So we have Costa del Pothcall. Woohoo! So we have a Costa coffee shop here. Now I have been to Pothcall, but I haven't been for a long time. So this is going to bring back some memories for me. Obviously, Costa isn't uh, exclusive to Puff Call, but you know, we, we can't go wrong with a Costa. <laughs> Amazing. I'm absolutely. I'm creased, which, if you're not from Wales, you might not know what that means. It doesn't mean my claws are, are wrinkly. Creased means um, I'm finding it very funny. <laughs> so, there's some Welsh slang for you there as well. So I like the fact that we've got the roads because obviously Porthcall is a built up city so I like that we've got the traffic on the roads here and some nice pavement with benches, lots of greenery. I'm very impressed how you've done this all just by researching a town online. It's actually really really impressive. So I love all your take on it so far. It's pretty accurate, pretty accurate so far. You know it's a town, it's uh, flowery <laughs> and has a cost it. So let's keep going. Let's have a look around. I have come by a dream. I did say that earlier. Not sure you'd find um, somebody so sophisticated as Anka in uh, Portugal, but <laughs> anything I say today, guys, please don't take offence. I take the, uh, I take the mick, which is make fun of Wales all the time. It's fine. I'm Welsh. So we've got high tide. I'm thinking this might be an arcade or amusement centre. Like I said, I have not been to Portugal in forever. Let's say hello to Jazz Croiso, yay, which is Welsh for welcome. Oh my gosh, your character's even speaking Welsh. I'm very, very impressed now. You have thought this through. Oh yes, we have the colourful beach huts on the beach, which they do have, they do have. And the campsite, oh, we have a caravan parked up. I'm sure we have a few of them and a playground oh, i love how we can just follow the road round and see how we go love the blue uh touches as well absolutely love it we have nooks crying yes oh my god yes we have elvis oh my god if you guys are familiar with wales um both call has an elvis convention like annually <laughs> so how amazing is this we have an elvis convention you can have a photo sitting in the car that's so funny 
Oh, I love it. I absolutely love it. And yeah, you just have like hundreds of Elvis uh, people in one place. So how funny is that? That actually made me feel so happy to see that. I've never been, but I'm desperate to go. I've seen the photos online. And yeah, where, why wouldn't you want to be where there's like a hundred Elvises in a room? <laughs> Cool, let's get going. Let's have a look at the rest of the island. So we have a Greg's, yay, vegan sausage rolls. <laughs> Jess, I'm, I'm in love, I'm in love. This is possibly my favorite thing ever. And we have streets in the background, which is like an old school nightclub. Oh, did you make that sign as well? I am, um, okay, I'm impressed. I'm very, very, very impressed. I'm gonna take a photo um, because I feel like anyone who knows Fourth call will know that club like the back of their hand. Lifeguard on duty. Oh, I love how you've got a little lifeguard section up there. I won't go into the houses, even down to the ice cream uh, cones on the floor. But I won't go into the houses. I'll leave that for you lot if you want to come and visit Fourth Call. Maybe you're from the USA and you want a little visit to Wales. Visit this island. I love that you've got a Greg's truck as well. Oh my gosh, I'm literally too excited. Fish and chips. You cannot have a seaside town without fish and chips. You really have captured the essence of Wales here, Jess. I'm loving it. Catch of the day. Yes, we have our fish shops and hot dogs. <laughs> we all know how much I love hot dogs. We have streets, 18 plus. We can queue to get into the club as well. Oh my God, I'm in love. I am actually in love. I can't wait to bump into Norm, the character, because this island is just for you. So I, I really hope you, you love it as much as <laughs> I do. Oh, we have a, um, oh, what's it called? A dock? No, you know what I mean. Amazing. Look at it. Look at the boats. That's so cool. A proper seaside village. You've captured it perfectly. I'm like so excited. I can't, I can't even speak. We have a surf shop. I'm sure there are plenty of them down at Port Call as well. We have a little forest here with some houses. I'm just going to run around the houses, make sure I don't miss anything. Yeah, okay. Oh, we have crazy golf or mini golf, whatever you call it. Oh, you've dropped pearls to look like golf balls. I'm going to put that away because I keep accidentally doing it. <laughs> Which is really clever. Look at this golf course. I adore that. We have the beach, commas, fourth goal. Oh my god, you've been, yeah, you've definitely made these signs. I'm literally, I'm shook. I have to take photos because, you know, I can't cope. I can't cope. I don't know if I've ever seen a Wales island. So please, if you've got a Wales island, let me know in the comments below. I want to see it. Fourth goal is uh, renowned for its uh, carnival slash arcade amusements, whatever you want to call it. So this is perfect. We even have rubbish on the floor, which is probably very accurate for a playground. We have amazing. We have these character stands. There's a lot of those. Oh, I love it. Yes, there's got to be amusements. I love that elephant as well. Duck shooting. Oh, amazing, amazing, amazing. Corny Beach, yes, very, very famous down Porth Call. So I think I'm gonna have to take a visit soon because I haven't been for so long. Let's have a little look down here. So we have some of the villager houses. <laughs> oh, this, we know Norm's been here because there's a, a beer on the floor. So, you know, <laughs> we know Norm's been here. Oh, amazing, amazing. Where is he? We, we I wish you could see people on the map. We are trying to find Norm, <laughs> our resident Porth Call uh, person. Oh, I didn't go to the museum, so we'll have to find that. This is really, really well done though. So I'm really, really impressed. I actually can't get over how you've built something without ever seeing it. You've captured the, the main heart of it anyway, definitely. There's definitely some some uh, better landscaped areas on your island, but why not? Maybe you could uh, <laughs> be the mayor. But I do actually know the mayor of Pothgall, so you know, not not to brag or anything. I'm uh, quite famous, <laughs> not really, but I I'm, I do genuinely know the mayor of Pothgall, so you know. Mm -hmm. We have our contact. So we have the museum with the parking area. That's really clever way to use your museum actually in a built up island. I think we've seen like quite a lot 
I don't know if I've missed anything. I hope I haven't. I'm gonna have a quick run round and hope to find Norm <laughs> somewhere, somewhere on the island. Which is his house? Is this is it this one that I'm by? Yeah, it is. I'm gonna go into this one to see if there's anything in there. So I literally feel like this tour we should all be clapping and cheering because I'm so impressed the fact that you've built this. Oh my gosh. So this is Norm's house. <laughs> Oh my god, that is hilarious because I just feel like you would literally want to live in a club. Oh, your house is streets. <laughs> you literally would be the happiest person on earth living there. I know it. I know it. And scarily accurate bedroom? I <laughs> Maybe you have been to Pope's Cold Dress. I, I think this is exactly what Norm's bedroom would be like as well. I'm actually so impressed. Okay, let's have a little look in here. I, 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 well, I will go upstairs and downstairs. I don't normally on tours, but I, I'm kind of intrigued as to what's in this house. So we have a little man cave kitchen area. Oh, I like that uh, record player rug on the floor. I can't say I've ever seen those before. Okay, I lied. I won't go upstairs and downstairs. There is no upstairs and downstairs. You could tell I'm overexcited. Didn't even notice. Okay, let's have a quick run around, make sure I haven't missed anything, and to see if we can find Norm. If I can't find him, I'm literally gonna cry. So let's have a little run around and see what we can do. Normally they're like by their houses, but you seem to be hiding. <laughs> you seem to be hiding. Where are you? But I'm actually so impressed uh, by your island, Jess. You've got some beach stuff. Oh, and a lighthouse. Amazing up there. I love the cars on the road. Well, I can't wait to see your next house. What are you, your next house, your next island. What are you building? Where are you gonna go from this? There's no way you can build anything better than this. <laughs> I'm so disappointed if we can't find everybody. I feel like you're hiding. Definitely somebody's hiding. Oh, we have lots of rocks on the beach. I should have definitely gone to the beach. Oh, a little doggy on the beach. Yeah, because Porthcall has a, a nice uh, sandy beach. I haven't been there for years though. I can't remember if it's majority sand or rocks. It might be like pebbly. Who knows? But please do let me know in the comments below if you are Welsh, from Wales, or you've just visited before. I'm actually devastated. I can't find Norm. I'm like so sad. I've run around and we can't find him. <laughs> Where are you? I've done a runner, but yes, I'm pretty sure we have seen everything and I am just absolutely yeah, I'm just absolutely in awe of what you've done. It's amazing. I'm going to have one last run around to see if we can find him. Because I feel like if we don't, we have failed. Because this tour is for him. So, you know, <laughs> this island was built for him by you. Very kindly enough, Jess. But, oh my gosh, I literally can't find anyone. I like these houses up here though. I like how you've decorated the area. I definitely haven't missed anything either. I think I've actually for once seen everything I'm supposed to see. Apart from Norm. <laughs> He's hiding. He's in streets somewhere. But amazing. Absolutely amazing. So guys, please do smash that like button. Please let me know in the comments below, like I said, if you're Welsh from Wales, if you've ever visited Wales or Porthcolo or just anywhere. And is there another island you'd want Jess to make next that she's maybe never seen? Maybe a, I don't know, Brazil island or some other place Jess may not have been. But yeah, we're gonna end it there because we definitely can't find any villagers. And Thank you so much for watching guys, please do like, subscribe, hit the notification bell and as always thank you for watching the playing and slaying. See you soon, bye!